Hey girls, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Mayra over here um, with new content, new videos, and new shit. You already know. So for today, I have this look here. I'm gonna show you how I transform from basic to Betty, and I'm gonna start using this baby skin um, primer for Maybelline. I already have my eyebrows done, and so far I like this primer. It makes my face looks really really smooth and I love it then I'm going to go ahead and slightly color correct uh, my imperfection mouth area under eye and a few dark spots that I have and I'm gonna blend out everything with like a blending brush <laughs> Next thing, I'm gonna prime my lids and I'm gonna use some of my LA Girl um, Pro Conceal and I'm gonna blend it out with my finger and then I'm gonna put some um, Laura Mercier powder and you will ask why is my Laura Mercier powder a little uh, yellow and it's because I mixed it with some of my um, buttercup from Sacha Cosmetics. So I wanted to keep this look um, chic and simple and for that I'm gonna start using my favorite um, transition color which is from the Nubian palette 1 by Juvia's Place. I love 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 this color as you guys can see I use it a lot. Then I'm gonna take this lighter brown to tone down um, the transition color that I put um, and make it like smoother and the area of the eyebrows of the brow bone you know then I'm gonna take this orange from the Morphe brushes 35O palette and I'm gonna apply it on my and the halo of my crease to be more precise and then I'm gonna take a darker brown and put it in the outer V of my eyelid and I'm gonna drag a little bit of that color into the crease at this point I'm not gonna lie to you guys I didn't even know what I was doing but I had an idea in mind so I tried to like follow my idea I wanted to look baddy and chic you know but at the same time simple didn't want to do nothing like really really crazy um, I grabbed this color also from the um, 35 o palette it's really pretty um, at the beginning when I played I was like um oh, I don't know but then I was like yeah I'm gonna go with this color and I did kind of a, I, I, I did cut the crease a little bit in the front and yeah I did blend the ends I didn't want to take the color all the way so I did blend it brown into the the shimmer color then I did an eyeliner with my Kylie um, black um, liner and I'm doing it like a little bit quick because I have already like a tutorial on how to do a wing liner so you can check my description bar if you want to learn how to do a wing liner you can check my description bar and check out my video I'm gonna put the link down there and I'm gonna go with my all-time favorite foundation drugstore foundation which is Maybelline fit me foundation in the shade coconut I love 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 this foundation so much I'm using a beauty blender to apply it all over my face and I'm going to highlight my face with this um, NYX Cosmetics HD Pro HD uh, concealer I don't know exactly the shade the shade and all the names so I'm gonna put all the information on the description bar for you guys to check if you have any question or you want to know anything about any of the products that I'm using they all gonna be in the description bar so check it out and yes by the way I know you guys notice I have straight hair now yes I didn't relax my hair but I did straighten in my hair 
um right here i am applying this black opal foundation stick to contour i don't know i think i'm gonna get a darker shade of this um of this foundation stick because i think this one is like really close to my skin tone and i'm gonna set all the concealer that i applied with my such a buttercup and i'm gonna be baking for a few minutes i'm gonna apply the baking powder to every area where i put the concealer and around my mouth and under my contour to make sure that it's really sharp you guys already know how a body has to look you know sharp contour and bomb ass halai <laughs> you already know i don't have to tell you everything so now i'm like contouring my nose i'm not really good at this but from time to time i like to try it I like to do it and i'm gonna set all my contour using this shade from my uh contour kit by anastasia beverly hills i love this contour so much and I'm going to set my whole face and dust all the excess powder with this True Much uh, L'Oreal powder. It's really nice. I use this powder basically every day. Not every, exactly every day, but most days when I do makeup, I use it as my base. I don't put foundation every day, so I do use this powder as a foundation every day that I use makeup. <laughs> I'm going to take the darker color on the medium palette one to deep to make my contour a little bit more deep and then i'm gonna up, i'm gonna put a little bit more of um powder under my contour while i'm gonna finish the rest of my face and then i'm gonna dust it up now i'm applying this um color pop uh, blush it's really cute and natural looking i didn't want a crazy uh blush so yeah for highlight i'm using the ultimate gold ultimate uh glow kit by anastasia i'm gonna take um the shade i just showed you and i'm gonna spray it with some um setting spray by maybelline if i'm not mistaken i don't know if it's maybelline or l'oreal i'll put everything on the description bar and yeah pretty much that's what i'm doing right now applying highlighter you know i have to get that nose highlight upping <laughs> I'm gonna put a little bit of highlight on my brow bone and the inner tear dot of my eyes on my eyes yeah right now I'm just dusting the powder that I apply and I'm gonna finish my eyes by applying some eyeliner black eyeliner on my waterline and smudging out that liner with some of the transition color that I apply first on my lids and yeah, I'm gonna put mascara um, so some of my a pair of violet was um, lashes I'm not really sure about the name so I'm gonna put everything on the description bar don't forget to check it out and I'm using this Marc Jacob mascara I love it so much yeah for my lips i'm gonna go ahead and use um true brown k by Kylie cosmetics and exposed and i'm gonna make like a ombre i'm gonna mix both colors to get the color that i wanted because i tried like several lipsticks and i didn't like how they were looking so yeah pretty much this is the one that i like the most and i think it looks really good and yeah right now i'm just gonna do something quick like a messy um bone messy high bun with my straight hair i'm gonna use a sock <laughs> to make the bun a little bit more um fluffy and i left a little hair in the front and i'm gonna flat iron it I don't know just wanted to play a little bit with my hair since it's been like two years since I had a straight hair so if you guys want to see a length check video you guys know I'm natural if you're gonna if you want to see a length check video I can do it and how I take care of my straight hair routine or whatever and yeah pretty much this is it 
I hope you did enjoy this video and I'm, I hope I didn't talk that much. And see you on my next video, girls. Love you so much and boys too. Bye. Mwah. Thank you.